Hi all, this is a continuation of delegates video, link provided in description box. Let's see how to pass function as parameter using delegate. In this sample console application created a class players and this class having two properties name and age and inside main functions hardcoded list of players and created two functions check eligible for cricket and check eligible for chess. If the player age is greater than or equal to 18 and less than or equal to 25 that player is eligible for cricket and if the player age is greater than 25 and less than or equal to 40 that player is eligible for chess and here get player list for cricket function and passing list of players as argument and game name inside that checking. Uh, if the player is eligible for cricket by calling this function if the player is eligible for cricket then displaying that player name same as for chess let's call this function calling the player list for cricket and get player list for chess let's check by running here we get the list of player list who are eligible here we created function for checking cricket and chess if we want to add more game we have to create a function for each by using delegate we can simplify this let's simplify by applying delegate here both the functions looking same except that here we are checking eligible players for cricket and here we are checking eligible players for chess uh, let's pass this function dynamically using delegate we are going to pass these functions so our delegate should match the signature of this function let's create a delegate public delegate return type is void boolean and delegate name players delegate and inside the bracket pass the parameter using this delegate you can pass this function as parameter. Let's remove one function. Delegate object. So this object will hold our passing function. So instead of calling this function, let's pass delegate object. Let's change the name of the function. Here, change the name. And pass this function. Check by running by using delegate, we get the list of players who are eligible for cricket and chess successfully. And also, we simplified the code using delegate. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.